All right, guys, I want to welcome y'all out here. We are on Normandy Lake, and we're down here at Barton Springs Access Area. And what we're doing is we're putting habitats. You guys have been out here. When we pulled up, it was chainsaws and guys running everywhere, and brick <laughs> blocks and, and string flying. But uh, tell me just a little bit about, first of all, what these are stacked on the boat. Each one of them has been worked on. It's not just a bunch of trees stacked in here. Yep. So tell me what it is that you were doing. Well, you know, every year we do Christmas for fishes across the entire state. And today what we did was we took 12 inch cinder block and we've tied uh, Christmas trees, four Christmas trees to each one of them. Uh, we've got about 400 Christmas trees out today. Last two loads are sitting behind us, you know, and we bring all the kids down. Uh, Jess with the TWRA, he's the lake manager down here and he comes out as a biologist to help place and, you know, give some instruction to the kids uh, why we're doing this type of thing. Uh, it helps, you know, what it helps and why you place them in certain areas, you don't just take them out here and dump them right. in 50 foot of water. Yeah. You know, um, and we try and, you know, that way we make sure we're not getting them in where people are going to water ski or, yeah. you know, all that good stuff. It's going to help the lake. Um, and, and that's a big part of what we're doing. And, you know, Philip with Coffee County Youth Bass Club, and then we've got some kids here from Franklin County Bass Club uh, in Tullahoma. Uh, youth bass club yeah they all come out and help yeah and you know basically by us doing this um it teaches the kids you know to keep to the put lake back up in and, not just take out but give back but they out. do you know they were all out here working yeah. their tails off and we pulled and, up the park and, and, and we're going to go out and we're going to do a lake cleanup too but it's all you know it's to give back a little bit and i know a lot of people well there's enough stuff in the lake but i'm going to tell you you know I looked at all the studies, and there's a couple of them out there that were done by people that are a lot smarter than myself and you and Jess. They're, they're the professors from uh, University of Mississippi and uh, UT and Tennessee Tech that done a lot of studies, you know, and people don't realize our reservoirs, our highland reservoirs like this one in Tennessee, right. the, the structure in them, the stumps and stuff is gone. There's nothing there left. So we've got to do stuff like this to keep the health of the lake. And up. you're adding the right type of habitat. You're not, yeah. well, you know, we already had the show once discussing <laughs> about the tires and things we used to do. Oh, you know, years man. ago we did different things, yep. but you're putting the right kind of habitat in, and you're taking, uh, like you explained today, all these Christmas trees that normally would just end up piled up in some field somewhere or burned, and you're putting them yep. to use. But now, uh, tell me this, Jesse, are there any particular species that? Are, are these for any particular species, or are all fish going to use these all, trees? All fish are going to use them, really, uh, but. You know, we find bass, we put an underwater camera down there occasionally to check them out and see how well they do, and we see all kinds of fish, from bluegill to, to largemouth to smallmouth even, yeah. and, and crappie, you know, they, they just, they love them, so um, algae will grow on top of them, and they'll, they'll help to feed the fish. And right, it starts grow. the whole process from the bait the all the way out, so, right. yeah, I mean, they're very beneficial to everything, so what we're fixing to do, we're fixing to load up and take these out to some, are we going to top secret locations, Jake, or are we going now, to? We're going to go to a couple of predetermined spots that Jess and I have come up with. Uh, they've had the, the main spot we're going to dump ours in is a uh, been a fish tractor site for years, mm -hmm. but it needs to be replenished because it doesn't last forever. Right, it doesn't. It eventually you know, breaks uh, up. You get a Christmas tree if it and... stays in the water, it's about five years. So we're going to go out and we're going to replenish that area, that one site with everything that's on that boat. Uh, and Jess is going to take the other boat and go around the end of the island over here um, and, and drop them there on some predetermined sites. And folks, all of these spots, whether it's Tim's Ford, Priest, no matter where, you can go to the TWRA website and get all of the GPS coordinates and it'll put you within about 30 feet of, if not right on top of it, but within about 30 feet of where these fish attractors are so that you can enjoy them and fish them. So, right, I they, love that they keep that we, information out we there We just for put, everybody. Uh, what, about 450 yeah, out at Tim's Ford State Park uh, just the other day. Jess yeah. come out and we did a big, big deal there. Yeah, this is a multiple lakes deal. I mean, we just yeah. happen to be at Normandy today, but, uh, we, you know, we had one of these planned actually at Percy Priest a few weeks ago and <laughs> had to cancel so it. And then we were going to be at Tim's <laughs> Ford and we had to cancel it. So, 
Uh, but that, that's just how it works sometimes. But this is something yeah. that you guys put effort into all of these lakes in Middle Tennessee. And we, we want every one of you that's watching to get involved in this stuff. Get over and, uh, and get involved not only in the habitat restoration, but also in the, in the cleanups, which we're going to talk more about later on today as yeah. well. So uh, lots of things you can do to help preserve these lakes and our waterways and, and do our part. So, well guys, let's get on out on the water and go find out oh, where we're gonna be putting these locators out. Yeah. 